Now, the aforementioned UK, seeing its power projections backslide as its empire was crumbling, sought to develop its own nuclear weapons. Another nation that sought out nuclear weapons was France. A nation with, at this point, diminishing prestige, seeing its empire collapse in a far more violent, messy, and embarrassing manner than those of the British. The French had already invested a great deal in nuclear power for civilian purposes, in which plutonium was a byproduct. French President Charles de Gaulle saw nuclear weapons as a sign of France being a first-rate power rather than a second-rate power. He was not only an anti-communist, but also had some reservations towards the Anglosphere, seeing them as allies of convenience rather than true friends. To this day, France's nuclear weapons program is not fully integrated with NATO. However, it remains the only nuclear armed power within the European Union ever since the UK left. 